If you are in Canada and you are planning on buying a home in the next 15 years, here's how you can save a bunch of money on your taxes so that you can beef up your down payment or save more for your other financial goals. If you don't know me, my name is Nicole Victoria. That's me. I teach women how to make more without working harder, save more without restriction and invest so that they can get paid while they sleep. So if you thought we already paid enough money in taxes at a time when everybody is feeling the pinch of inflation, the Canadian government says, nope. We think you can pay more. The rich know one of the best ways to save money is to pay less taxes. That's why so many of them own businesses. But for people who work a regular nine to five, what options do they have? One is something called the FHSA account, which is essentially an investing account made for first time home buyers to assist them in investing and saving up for a down payment on their first home. Now, the beautiful thing about this account is any money you put into the account is a tax deduction for you at the end of the year. This write off on your taxes reduces the amount of tax that you need to pay and it can be significant. And if you open an account before December 31st, even if you don't have any money to put in, you will accrue $8,000 of contribution room. So let's look at an example of how powerful this is. Let's say that you make seventy thousand dollars a year in Ontario. If you contributed the full eight thousand dollars to that account, that means you would bring the amount of taxes that you have to pay down from twelve thousand eight hundred forty seven dollars to ten thousand four hundred seventy five. This will save you two thousand three hundred seventy two dollars in taxes. Once you get that refund in twenty twenty four and you have accrued more contribution room, you could put that money right into your FHSA account and that two thousand three hundred seventy two dollars would be a deduction on your twenty twenty four taxes, saving you even more money. The even better part Invest that money into the stock market for your long-term goals or something like a GIC for your short-term goals and any money you make inside that account is tax-free. It's like the benefits of the RRSP and the TFSA combined. Even if you don't have the money to contribute right now, I would still open the account so that you can start gaining that contribution room. Follow for more money hacks or get started learning about money with our free money trainings. Find them on our website under freebies. Let's get you rich.